From a charity perspective, I think one of the fundamental starting points for any major bespoke national partnership like the one we've launched with Deloitte is to ensure that there's that real strategic alignment. Um, what the conversations we had in the early days with Deloitte and what the partnership has kind of come to is something that directly feeds into two of our key impact goal areas as a charity. One of those is around um, reducing the young people from low-income backgrounds who are neat a year out of compulsory education and another is around um, increasing access for young people from low-income communities to the most selective universities in the UK. Um, and I think that strategic alignment has to be the foundation of any major partnership. Um, if it's not feeding directly into your charity strategy, um, then you really need to question why it is then that you're doing it. I think other reasons um, and other kind of key factors in any major charity business partnership includes the kind of buy-in and alignment you have with that business. We have incredible senior and right through the business um, buy-in from Deloitte partners and chairman um, and that's been really instrumental in kind of getting this kind of partnership off the ground. Um, so I think that's a really kind of key factor as well. Um, and then finally just to ensure that you know the elements of the partnership are actually driving things that are priorities for you as a charity. Um, the Deloitte, the support we receive from Deloitte directly funds key core programmes that Teach First delivers and has and that have fantastic success and that we are actively looking to expand. Um, so I think those sort of the strategic elements, the, the buy-in and the alignment with the chat with the between the charity and business generally, um, and that kind of direct funding and priority alignment are, are really key elements.